I had some experience uh, working on a previous PBS series called Makers about women in politics, and that was several years ago. But at the time, I had met Rashida Tlaib, who was then a state representative for Michigan from Detroit. And meeting Rashida was kind of eye-opening because I'd never met someone in politics who felt so accessible, who felt, um, you know, she was a daughter of immigrants, bilingual, grew up in the Midwest like me, um, mother of two small children, and really rooted in her community. And I'd never met anyone in politics or seen anyone in politics like that. And I remember thinking, oh, I want someone like, I would love for someone like her to represent me. All of us have different experiences. I have the experience of being an immigrant. Grace has an experience of being a mother and someone who grew up in the Midwest. Our experiences are different. But if the people who are making the decisions about our lives shared more in common with our experiences as people, then the decisions that are made about our lives would be more reflective of our needs. Actually seeing women doing the things that we are told we are often not able to do will inspire people. I know that when we were filming, you know, we were in so many rooms where we saw young women, um, young people of color whose eyes would light up when they would see our candidates or other organizers, people just taking command of the room and you know, really, lean, really leaning into um, their values. Every one of us could participate um, really by just raising our voices. For, you know, it's, a, it's a continuum, it's a spectrum. For some people it's gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna go show up to a city council meeting for the first time, or I'm gonna sign up for an email from my representative. The other end of that line, you might be standing at a podium running for office.